What is up guys, Mr. The Reverts here and Modern Warfare is still winning a lot of fans over every single day, little by little as more pieces of information comes out about the game and it really just seems like whenever Charlie Intel is tweeting information about the game, my timeline just gets filled with tweets about it or there's gonna be a lot of positive replies saying like, hey, that's pretty cool or I really like that idea and I have the same exact feelings for this cool customization feature of a Tamagunchi or Tamaguchi, however you wanna say it in modern warfare so basically if you guys don't know what this is it's kind of like a little um, analog digital pet that you can have on your wrist or you can clip it on your backpack if you were as a kid if you have one of these um, but basically it's like a digital pet that um, you can take care of it can talk to you and just do all that kind of fun stuff there um, but you can actually have this in a modern warfare which is kind of cool at the same time and it's gonna be a part of your little watch that your character can have have in game which I did discuss briefly a couple of weeks ago but now we actually have more information coming from this Game Informer magazine which I'm gonna link down below in the description and like I said you can equip a Tamaguchi on your watch now instead of feeding it or giving it water providing nurturing care etc these pets actually live off kills in the game so to keep this pet happy you have to go on a kill streak and it's gonna chirp whenever you do that uh, but if you go on a death streak then the pet will get very angry with you and demand you to do better in the game which I think is pretty funny to say the least and the Tamaguchis do evolve from eggs in the game and then like I said as you progress the pet's gonna evolve unless you start sucking at the game then it will start to rot and die apparently. Obviously you're not required to add one of them in your game but it definitely could give you more fun in the game and incentives to do better. Now I definitely do see these pets becoming a part of microtransactions like maybe you can have a pet dog or a pet dragon or something cute and cuddly like a bear if you so please I don't know just definitely think of this as like the reactive camos from black ops 4 where if you go on a kill streak then something in the game is gonna react to you doing really really well which I'm totally okay with but definitely these watches are gonna be a part of the microtransaction loot pool in Call of Duty Modern Warfare along with what everyone should have expected operator skins however each operator has their own various personalities appearances voices etc executions and even skins and again all of this information is coming from the Game Informer interview with the Infinity War developers and from what it looks like there appears to be no same character appearance different color bullshit or same character we're just gonna throw in a bunch of different like pockets on the person's vest like there's nothing like that at all from what it seems like each operator skin and customization item is gonna be vastly different from the rest which I absolutely love to hear and that's one of my biggest pet peeves about about Black Ops 4 there's so many different customization items that are exactly the same thing but for a different specialist character or there's the exact same camo for every single weapon in the game which is just greedy beyond belief hopefully that's not gonna be in modern warfare um, for the rest of the duration but who knows Activision is known to change stuff up and the developers to even I'm not really all too sure honestly who to blame but definitely um, it does not seem like neither parties are committed to uh, their word when it comes to microtransactions all that stuff can change um, but also there are no specific type of customization item that can be added to each character like for example you can't unlock a shoe for one operator or then unlock a hat for another everything is already predetermined when you unlock one skin for the operator as a whole which I think is a very very good idea and and again hopefully this does not dilute the loot pool because that's my biggest concern with microtransactions and I think with the communities in general um, if they can do micros correct in modern warfare like this game honestly could be shaping up to be the best call of duty like ever created if not definitely in the top three um, so yeah those are my thoughts guys about micros and modern warfare there are gonna be a lot for sure don't get me wrong but as long as it's you know fun content at the same time that doesn't change up your stats or make you a better player or you know completely camouflage you in the game something like that then I'm totally okay with uh, this stuff in the game but those are my thoughts guys please tell me yours down below in the comments thanks so much for watching love you all so so much till next time i'll see you later